night, as the carpenter was locking up his workshop, he'd already switched off the light, so he didn't notice that a big black poisonous cobra had slid into his workshop. Now, the snake was just looking for food, but as it slithered around there in the dark, by accident, it rubbed against the blade of a double-edged metal axe that was leaning against the wall, and it got very slightly injured. The snake, however, was furious, and so, wanting revenge and knowing the power of its own bite, it decided to bite the metal blade of the axe with its full force. Now, as you can imagine, the metal axe was not going to get affected by the bite at all, but the snake's mouth got really badly injured and it started to bleed. Unfortunately, this made the snake even more angry, even more determined to get revenge. And so, in its own arrogance, it decided it was going to strangle and kill this creature that was trying to hurt it. And so the snake wrapped itself tightly around the double-edged metal blade of the axe and squeezed. The next morning when the carpenter opened his workshop, he was very surprised to find a chopped up snake lying littered across his floor. So what's the moral of this story? Very simply, your reactions are entirely your decision. I'm not saying we shouldn't react. I'm saying we need to be consciously aware of what it is that we choose to do, because whatever it is that you choose to do, it will affect you as much as it will affect anybody else.